fall. Feeling great today. And looks like it's going to be sunny day. Sun is already heating. Getting ready to pack up. Trying my sleeping bag a little bit. It got a little bit wet here, but not really much. I'm gonna drive fast and I just put this rock. Let's see how it looks today. There is Janis over there also drying his sleeping bag. It was raining and you got a little bit wet, no? Yeah. yeah. Looks beautiful today. Some granola and oatmeal with a blueberry. What are you making, Janice? I'm gonna make some. I have these little. Breakfast eggs. Breakfast skillet. Yeah. Nice. Give it a shot. That's good. <laughs> Having a breakfast, healthy breakfast today. Getting some energy. Now having some coffee. The leg is all the way over there. I just came out this way. Take care of business. And now my friends and I are almost ready to pack their packs and we are ready to move so my goal is to make it out to Onion Valley today uh, and I think my friends are gonna stay one more night in uh, Kersars Lake so let's see how it goes coming back uh, last day, yesterday, was nobody in the car, just us and one more, one more or two more people. It was super quiet. I mean, that was two, two days ago. Uh, last night, there is more people, but still not much as another seasons, I think, where sometimes this lake can be full of uh, tents. I saw maybe like six tents around. So let's go back. Now we are leaving. This was a nice campsite. We are leaving Red Lakes now. Perfect weather right now. sign again somebody still didn't recover their water bottle since yesterday so we gotta keep moving you start seeing more people on the trail since this weekend it's a little bit more crowded but on the weekdays barely you see some people it's going to be a fun day especially going to through Glen Pass again with the snow. <laughs> Upper view of Red Lakes. Now the funner part, now the funner part comes. Now going up is a different feeling than, than going down. It's more energy to burn. Now 
nice thing about that trail is full of snow but you can see people is been hiking here so that helps a lot and also having sense of I was all the way over there going all the way up now this part of the trail has a lot of snow and rocks I can see some people over there coming down maybe hard to see it but I can hear the voices too okay let's keep going you can see my friends I know they are good because Dennis has a GPS tracker and he told me to go ahead and try to get there first very nice again the blue blue water blue ice water there is the lakes over there doing good progress I'm almost there too right over there that peak over here I'm almost there then just go down now I have to go from the snow so I'm going to wear my micro spikes and look at the view guys beautiful micro spikes I already passed that part so now look safer now just gotta follow the foot trail make it to the top I just made it up my friends are almost here and from here I will say bye to them they will camp in Carsarge Lake and I will go back to the parking lot in Onion Valley Amazing. Drawing my shoes a little bit, even some snow. It's almost dry now, but not too bad. The Janis and Elsa Rainbow. Made it to Big Dancer and Tenkara. <laughs> Come on, Janis. Big dancers, just don't fall. <laughs> I just ran from all the way over there to here. I already say, see you soon to my friends because it's not gonna be the last time we are back biking together. I'm gonna head to the parking lot of Onion Valley and try to get a permit to Whitney because I really want to do Whitney tomorrow if possible so guys I'll just do small recording videos until I get back safe to the to the parking lot in Union Valley thank you for following please like and subscribe me down baby and then up and then down see what it says that's Charlotte Lake over there that's where I camped two days ago so I gotta go to Onion Valley which is going to be that way uh, 7.5 to Onion Valley no bad Carsers Lakes 3.1 that's where my friends are camping for the night but I'm gonna just keep going Six 
6.7 miles to Red Lake. Curses Lake, those were my friends, my camp tonight too. I'm gonna go up. To the, to the top. Ooh. I'm gonna stop from Glen Pass coming down. Pretty nice. Coming down to Onion Valley. Not too hard now. I'm almost there. Hello, guys. Take care. How far is the lake? Oh, you are almost there. Almost there. Yeah, right? almost there. Okay, Maybe 10, 15 more minutes. Thank you. You're welcome. I just made it to to the park in Adonian Valley and I meet some guys that are through hiking the PCT and I uh, take them at least the closest to town that I can. Once more people getting ready to. I just meet uh, these three guys in the section of Onion Valley. Clutch, they'll right. give us a ride. Very nice yes. to meet you. Nice back. to meet you and good luck in your journey. God protect you guys. Thank you. What is your trail name? I'm sorry. Dusty. So Dusty. collectively, we're the three amigos. Oh, I see. Okay. I like that better. Lucky. Nutty. Nice. Okay, guys. Yeah. Take care. Have fun. Yeah. Okay. Don't forget anything. Awesome. Okay. And after the 15 miles hike, on ribs, chicken, brisket, coleslaw, mashed potato or potato salad I mean just leaving three guys, visitors in Bishop came to one of my favorite barbecue places in Bishop